British tennis sensation Emma Rajikanu will return to Wimbledon's grass courts for the first time in two years but first faces a tough test in Eastbourne Emma Rajikanu is on course to face so-called world's richest tennis star Jessica Pagula ahead of her Wimbledon return. The British tennis ace's preparation for her home Grand Slam gets underway at Eastbourne on Monday morning. Rajikanu, currently 165th in the world rankings, will first need to beat Sloane Stephens in the ATP tournament's round of 32. The 21-year-old is coming off the back of a 7-6, 3-6, 4-6 defeat to Katie Bolter in the semi-final of the Nottingham Open last week. Victory against Stevens will put her up against world number 5 Pagula, who is known as much for her formidable skills as her eye-watering net worth of around £5.4 billion, which has earned her the tag of world's richest tennis player. That takes into account her father's net worth, which she stands to inherit. Terry Pagula's extraordinary wealth stems from his involvement in the oil and gas industries, as well as his sports empire which includes ownership of NFL side Buffalo Bills and the NHL's Buffalo Sabres. But Rajikanu will face a tough test against Stevens on the South Coast before she is able to play the 30-year-old Pagula. Stevens has previously sat as high as third in the WTA rankings, though Rajikanu came out on top in their only ever meeting in 2022. Both opponents provide a challenge for the Brit who was recently granted a wild card spot at this year's Wimbledon, which gets underway on July 1. Rajikanu has never won in SW19 and it will be her first appearance there in two years, following wrist and ankle surgery last year. Her only Grand Slam triumph to date came at the US Open in 2021, aged just 18. Victory made her the first British woman in 44 years to win the tournament. Rajikanu also became the first qualifier to ever win a major, all without dropping a single set. She has struggled with injuries and a loss of form since that Grand Slam victory, however. Rajikanu withdrew from the French Open in May, deciding to miss the Paris competition in order to maintain her fitness for the remainder for 2024.